been a bad influence. Mm -hmm. But knew of his, you know, tactics. Yes. His current tactics as well. It's not like he placed him there and he changed into something else. No, that's what I'm saying. He, the king, obviously knows how he is. I just, so if the king didn't place him there in order to help his son with good intent, if he in fact does have a web, is he what holding something of the king? Does he have that strong of a web? Is he a man who's trying to make power grabs, or is he working for someone else? That's true. What if... Fulgriff never, never gave Gavis that thing we found? Ah! Headache. Mm. I'm sorry, what? What if Fulgriff I never tried gave to ask... Gavis that mm. thing he found? And he's holding it against them. I tried to ask. Gavis seemed completely aloof. <clears throat> Gloria, scribe. Out. Mm. No. Of course. The rest of you stay put. So every door in this a scribe thing the, the other squeaky. I'm oh, still metal hinges. Come on, scribe with. Don't know what WD forty is. Right. Right. Yes. Cool. Oh, shit. Either they're going to get it out, or... Can't really do much. Nope, absolutely not. Actually. Just curious, so... What? at the door. Hmm. Nervous, Sarah? There's a really big hole in those cracks. Why are you missing an ear? If this wasn't made of stone and it was wood, you'd get away with that. Mm. I was wondering if you could. Don't elves hear better than he? No, not through stone. No. Unfortunate. We don't have better hearing, we have more sensitive my hearing. Oh, I see. We can't hear louder. But I have an always do. Interesting, uh, alright. Is that why you don't get freaked out from loud noises? Who yes, they don't work like fucking mega. And who? Fair enough. Is your loyalty? <coughs> like megaphones. I thought he was fighting something. <laughs> the door's closed, you fucking. I shit. know, I'm not doing anything. Oh. This door is taunting me. <laughs> Indeed it is. <laughs> Did you hear that thing? The door's squeaky. <laughs> the wind. It's squeaky. <clears throat> it's a bit giraffe. <laughs> what the fuck? Just punched. I like punching steel. What about the barrels? <laughs> What are these barrels and 
There's coffee in this. Think of how much money there is. How much silver do you think that entire bag is? Coffee. Think I could take a hand. I don't think push your luck, cat. Did you just eat? Servant, servant, spit that back. Servant, servant, stop. Stop it. Stop it. I'm sorry. I know, but stop it. Can't eat. Are you hitting them with the stem as well? What <laughs> the fuck is going on there? What? Better be nothing. What? Of course not. Hello? <laughs> it's so hey, dark in here. Stop. Stop. You know, those are cherries. They're gonna find the whole pits. <laughs> yeah, good idea. I'm gonna eat this coffee. They're gonna kill me, I'm gonna <laughs> fucking bankrupt them. <laughs> no. Do you think if we eat some, we can at least be caffeinated? Oh my god, I'll be so fucking quick. For caffeinated, use code low eight for 10% off. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> yeah, I'd rather die. And here's your stupid fucking code. <laughs> How does shit to put my water? That's gonna be a placebo to make me feel more energetic. What do you mean? It's just coffee beans. Cheese service, what do you have against coffee? Ba 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 Are you twerking? Oh. I'm <laughs> stretching. Let me show you how proper it is to do it. Okay. <clears throat> it's all about the technique. Do you have something stuck in your ass cheeks? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually clenching the key to the door. <laughs> Shoved it up in there earlier. Picked it off a guard. No one could know. Humanity's best pocket. Seraph. <laughs> Stop this. So why? <sighs> Trying to fuck. protect us. Boy. Yeah. I'm not be doing anything. No. No. Uh, we're oh. breeding. I have to watch. You have to. <laughs> I don't feel anything otherwise. The cherries will protect us. <clears throat> Shut up, you fucking weirdo. Hey chat, how you holding up? You enjoying the session? We're kind of oh, just been a lot of waiting, I guess, but you know. Go ahead and follow Loren over on Twitch and Falcona. <clears throat> Do it now! Lal! Wait, let's see. They're dead. 100% the dead. In fact, if you go down here, you can see Fractured Thrones, you click on that, and it will show everyone who's alive right now. <sighs> Look, there's me! Look, there's me! There's me again! <laughs> You, you, up, on your feet. 
Did not hear that door open. <clears throat> what happened to the squeaky hinge doors? This message you were given is described words truth. Is the hand on your shoulder and moves you at first? Which direction are we going? Yes, open the door. Right. What's this? What's this? The Lord has asked for the presence of the two drow. Very well. forward. On your left, here. Here, boy. Here. What has brought you here to Dunstead Keep? We are accompanying uh, the courier, Lord Commander. Under what premise? Why does he need either of you? We can see better in the dark. We're traveling at night. So why bring both? Two eyes are better than one. You are both known here at Unstead. I think you're aware of that. Yes, sir. At least by some of the guardsmen. The last time you were present, you caused a commotion in my courtyard. And made men start killing each other. Never really paid for that, did you? No, sir, it wasn't by our choice. Aye, I know. House Attenwood at its finest. Yes, we met them on the way up here again. Irregardless. I will deal with that. What I need to know is why you were sent here. In totality. What was the purpose of this trip? Sir, to deliver the mes message from Lord Godfrey that the courier had on him. Lord Godfrey. This missive that you received from Lord Godfrey, did you see it handed to the courier with your own eyes? I don't recall, sir. I don't think so. What about you? So no one has seen this except the courier. No one can verify that Lord Godfrey has actually given this missive whatsoever. Did it not have a seal on it, Lord? Oh, my eyes. A seal can be taken. And Lord Godfrey has either suggested treason, or his seal was taken after he departed Castle Ledford. I need to find out which. Apparently you knew the man? He's not lying, sir. Speak. He's not lying. I didn't see them exchange, but he's been talking about it for the last day or two. Godfrey had approached him a day ago, saying he would have something for him to do. This is that thing. It is to be kept secret, so no one knows about it. <laughs> My lord, Ledford is a snake pit. I'm aware. Godfrey's words. Shut that is troubling that he would say that. No. Very troubling indeed. I think he's confused. Make confused? 
It is one or the I other. I said he was heading towards the snake pit, so referring to our neighbors. Neighbors. What? I'm sure I don't have to elaborate on it. I see. <clears throat> Find them. Take the drow female, see if her answers are the same. It will be done to hear is to obey. Attend me, drow. Heading towards the snake pit. Towards our neighbors. And who exactly is Lord Godfrey referring to as a snake pit if not Ledford? I am unsure, sir. I'm just a drow. <clears throat> That is no excuse when carrying a missive as powerful and important as this. Didn't know how powerful it was. You'll forgive me, my I have not yet decided if I will. When was this missive given to your courier? Believe when? It. Believe it was last night. And you traveled in the middle of the night here. Yes, Lord. Stop creaking in that chair, you idiot. Sorry, my lord. <laughs> in the middle of the night. Tell me, Drow. Why didn't Lord Godfrey send one of his own couriers? Why a bunch of peasants? I asked that to the courier. He must have said something. I asked that to the courier myself. He said that he... didn't trust some of the royal couriers. Is what I was told. Didn't trust the couriers. It sounds more and more like Lord Godfrey was looking to commit treason. Did not use the official lines of communication. He's encouraging me to take my own personal royal guard and surround the heir to the throne with it. it sends peasants in the middle of the night. Right after word from advisor Falgrith that he believes that this event that took place with King Aelis was Godfrey's doing. What else do you know? That's all I know of, sir. About the message. <coughs> what else? Do you know about my <coughs> patience is running very thin? <sighs> Fulgrith is a snake. I think that's pretty well known. <coughs> a snake. Uh... Advisor Fulgrith has served King Aelis faithfully. Since before Arolend even became what it was. Has Godfrey not? And you want me to believe that? Godfrey has served Arolend, yes. A military man and an honorful one through and through, but... He is not quiet about his displeasure with the air. Never has been. I'm unsure of politics, my lord, you'll have to forgive me. It's above me. <coughs> Not much I can tell. Put him back with the others. Come. 
Matter of fact, no. Bring him to the captain. Let him ask his questions. one back to the cells. Tans in the back. Into the room. No, no, no. That way. Come on. Take a seat, draw boy. So, you're not a slave. You work for the scribe. This I already know. Yes, sir. Why come back with those who incited violence? No, uh, we didn't Tell me incite not. it. Keep it short and so, keep it simple. We didn't incite it. it no, was, you didn't. No, the uh, Last other time house. here, there was a greatest hunter in all of Ledford. The second time, there was another incident with a blacksmith. And then they come again. The same courier. In the same drow. Causing more trouble. You see how this looks? Have we caused trouble? Sir? Why are you assisting them? Yes, much. Mm. You? No. But you attended them nonetheless. Knowing they've been here prior, yes? Knowing that they caused trouble before. Knowing that they, they not got tell into you? trouble. Yes, Captain. Good. Good. No, I know, which story doesn't line up. Ouch. Appreciate it, Drow. Now then. Who are you loyal to? The scribe, Gavis. Forgrith. Answer now and answer quickly. The Lord. By in turn, everyone. Are they not on the same page? Lord who? Gavis. He is the ruler, is he not? Blood. Everyone should be on the same page. You mentioned yes, all three royal people. blood, yes. He's from the royal house. Mm. I'm not too into politics. You'll have to forgive me. I'm, it's above me, but from what I understand, yes. Did you see the courier being handed the missive from Godfrey? Yes or no? No. But I heard him talk about it prior. Godfrey, that is. <clears throat> heard him talk about it. <sighs> it's not good enough. You have to do better, Drow. Who else knows about the missive? Who else knows you're here? Uh, everyone who's here. That's all I'm aware of. So you came alone. Knowing no one was here to help you. No one. Yes, alone with the group. But you didn't think to tell anyone prior where you were from, where you were going, in case something happened. You just willingly came. I did not Your know. deaths. Captain, I'm a drow. I don't have much to live for. I am not a captain. I am a sergeant. Apologies, I thought someone told you. Captain. Sergeant Alabaster. Oh, geez, sorry. Now then, why is suicide with a missive that contradicts ours? It wasn't necessarily a suicide. What do you hope to gain? To deliver the message. That's literally the only thing I hear. You know they say don't shoot the messenger. I wish. But you didn't have to. You came willingly of your own accord. Yes. 
Yes. Along with your scribe, master. Yes. Good. Loyalty. Take this one back to the south. I have what I need. Go on. With me. Make way. When did you receive this missive? This missive was received, uh, well, depending on where the moon is, uh, earlier this evening or. It came to you earlier, hidden it in the courier's lounge. It did. It told me. You alright, Kyla? His throat's all bruised up. said you're in the viper's nest. It's unsafe. Uh -huh, I could have told the spirit that. <laughs> the viper's nest. <laughs> well, we've already figured that much out. Well, it could be two of them. It's one of two things. Either the guard will be already pissed off, or maybe the ghost knows that to hear is to obey as well. I think that's just not what you think it is. <clears throat> Perhaps. I hope I'm wrong. I believe it's a common thing. The one I've heard. Is it common because it's a established Aryland tradition, or is it common because so many in so many places serve Ulgrith's interests? I think it's drilled into them when they go to being royal guard school. If you want my honest answer, Mirandel. Uh -huh. Maybe I'm just paranoid. Rightfully so. But they definitely all have the right to be right now. Tarek's upset at you and Kat for not telling him the truth. Tarek? He essentially forced me to. Yes. I didn't see it. I don't reckon trying to lie about anything would uh, serve us well. It's not like we have anything to hide. Hmm. It's an interesting saunter you've got going on there. This is what happens when you put me in a fucking room for hours. Mm-hmm. You sure are a restless individual, aren't you? I think it's those cherries that she ate earlier. <clears throat> ate like 18 handfuls of them. That's what I heard. You know those things make you have to use the restroom? Sorry, the powder room. Hmm. Oh, please spare me. God, just kill me, please. <sighs> this is something in it. Good old Dunstead. Dunstead. You know, and here I was hoping the Lord was sending me over to Adwick, along with all the other requests that were happening. I was so excited. Dumbstead. I don't think my stomach could have dropped any further or faster once he mentioned Dunstead Keep. What do you think Dunstead's keeping? 
keeping me contained. Why are there siege weapons? Um. At least they need to attack something, is what I heard from one of the noobles. What is around that needs to be attacked? I don't know. I figured out what was in the missive. What? Apparently it was... So are you. Or... Lord, Com Lord Commander to gather troops and surround. No, it wasn't that. That's what he told me. Apparently, the Lord mentioned that the letter he had opened up read as such. Lord Godfrey was requesting that Lord Commander Morrigan, or Merrigan, take a good number of his household troops Take him over to Ledford and replace Gavis's own guard there. That's basically what he told me. Which, by Merrigan's eyes, would be both seizing a captive and treason. The way I see it, I can understand what Godfrey's getting at. He wants the troops that are loyal to Fulgriff to rotate out with those that are loyal to him, protecting the Lord. He and lifted me seem... by my throat and asked me what else I knew after explaining basically everything there, and I just said Fulgriff's a snake, and you know that. <laughs> rough with me like that. Fuck. And he seemed to drop Despite me. Despite whatever altercation occurred... It seems that Lord God. A bold move. Still... Let's hope it pays off. Nothing else. <laughs> I didn't give any. He knows that what... Fogger took my ear. Well, I told him that he was a fucking snake, and he knows that already. So mm -hmm. I don't know. Now, well, based off of the contents of that letter, it would appear that despite whatever may have happened between Godfrey and Lord Gavis, he still remains loyal. He just understands that there's a middleman who's playing a bigger role than they're supposed to. God, this waiting is agonizing. We're going to return to Ledford and immediately be arrested by Fulgrith. And ask what happened here. Most... Like, oh, of course. He knows where In that case, we delivered the letter and so questioned. Not sure what the letter entailed, but... No, there were people in the courtroom that were probably looking at him while he was explaining what was in the letter. But we don't know what was in the letter. No. Lord Commander told us, told me in the courtroom with other you members think there. Fulgrith will care? I see. If we do get arrested, oh, yeah, we, we don't have know to what's in the letter, and we took it over here to uh, no. That's the Lord problem. Commander Merrigan. That's the problem. Yes, we don't know what it is. No, it's not saving us. It won't save us from Fulgrith either. If he's okay. a courier, or a messenger, he's seen us here, and no doubt to report back to the snake. Yes, and they will report back to the fact that the Lord Commander explained to us what was in the letter. So we can't lie and say we don't know what was in it. Um, we left as soon as we could. It is the early morning. <gasps> if that is the case, we have to be completely truthful. To Fulgrith. Yes. You're right. One should. However. Especially if, if this falls However. Through. If what was in that letter is true, if what the Lord Commander was saying, does that make us accessory to treason? I don't know. The problem is, well, the Lord. It's not even treason care? if, if it's not treason, if he's just replacing the guard. Right. Lord Commander it feels like it's treason. He does. But even then, it, the problem with. If we return, there is no reason to buy the and Lord, Lord Commander Merrigan 
We should, but if Lord Commander Merrigan doesn't lend his troops, he does not send them to replace the guard, at least accompany them over at Ledford. And that means we return to Thorgriff and Lord Gavis. Thorgriff, if he knows we were here, will arrest us, no doubt, interrogate us, and probably do as he sees fit. Heck, probably execute us. And it's not like there's any other Lord Commander Merrigan. No Godfried there to stand in the way or defend it. There's only Lord Gavis. And Lord Gavis is a puppet of Falkreath. <sighs> so if we go back to Ledford and the Hended, we're right fucked. really should keep these adventures to myself, shouldn't I? Well, at least I would have died alone. can't really do anything, can we? Let's be honest. We just have to wait for the Lord Commander's fine judgments to hopefully pull through. Uh, Although I'm sure there are... His mouth, or his mm. feature and his figure, for that matter. Yes, let us hope that the Lord Commander is appropriately proportionate. Brains and bronze. Most mm. people think you can't have one without the other. I hope they're not giving Kat too hard of a time. Poor girl. Yeah, she'll talk She's her way out of it. She's been longer than any of us. She doesn't know as much as we do either, which might upset them. Well, because she talks too damn much. Especially for a woman. <laughs> You're not fitting in here, Amy. You're crazy. Scoot over. No, oh, I'm me. laying down. You all, up! Come forth before the Lord. Mm. <sighs> Follow up behind them. Attend me! Move, God. This is it. <clears throat> Come on. Make way. Hurry up! Lord Godfrey left us quite hastily. Line up in front of the Lord! Come on! Hmm. Yes, yes it is. What is the overall belief of my court? Before the information suggested, I would be enlightened with the belief of Fulgurth. He has given no reason to show any distrust or disloyalty to the court. He has helped King Aelis long before his tenure, and he has faithfully served Lord, Lord Gavis. However, the information is disturbing, but it does shake 
at foundation a bit, but I'm still light to, to believe that Vol Fulgrith stands with the kingdom and the king. I still prefer the third option. However, if that is not possible, then we have to make a decision. Hearing what I've heard, what the captain says seems true. I feel like we should go with the more recent. So Everything we've heard, I, from my point of view, at least, I feel as though what the peasants have brought is, in my personal opinion, the truth. Mainly because why would Godfrey ever not, not go through official channels and he truly distrusted them? And given that he was in lead for the time, his distrust is warranted given what the mm. that, is my, that is my point. And what are we to do with these people? Hmm. Hmm. You clearly came here knowing the risk. Either you're quite stupid, or very brave. Indeed. My or Lord, loyal. If I may offer an idea. Speak. Keep them here. If we are to believe their missive, we can keep them here in, in just in the prisons. And if it turns out that their missive was wrong, we can say that. They were the ones that sent it to us. We can have them hanged for it, instead of you. That sounds wise. Also covers up that we're believing them. And it's understandable we would keep them here after what they did last time. I support what she suggests as well. To imprison them until we find out whether or not this missive is actually true or not. Is that what the court says? Aye. Aye. Yes. Yes. Aye. Lord Commander, if I may. Hmm. Speak. What does your God tell you? I know Lord Godfrey is a honorable man. And he's put all your all of his trust in you. With dismissive, that much I know to be true. I would uh, for whatever it means to you. If he remains loyal to Gavis by extension, so do Quiet, me. Courier. Speak, Scrub, and quickly. I will just say that I did not lose an ear, did not get these scars by disobeying Lord Godfrey. It would seem, according to my captains, that your stories match up for the most part. You have that in your favor. Either I am to march west and intercept Lord Godfrey by force and take him into custody or I am to march north and secure Castle Ledford and the Prince's safety. Those were the options given to me by these missives. Both are treasonous. 
And neither is a choice that I am eager to make. In answer to your question, scribe, my gut tells me that there's something I'm not being told. It is no secret that Lord Godfrey does not approve of Lord Gavis as heir. He is a military man, an honorable man, but he's headstrong too. And I do not know what he would do if he thought he knew better. As it stands, the king might be dead. <sighs> then this is what I will do. Scribe. Everything and anything that has to pertain to what you have brought to me. Give it a moment. You will remain where you are and you will not move. He is very tall. You respect <clears throat> the Lord. Not tall anymore, though. Turned into a chair. A silent. I have not been given. Oh my god, he turned speak. into a chair. Holy shit. Treason. <laughs> Treason. Please be respectful. <laughs> he he well, sat on the Lord. The Lord has so he has to do Lord Bell. Give me permission to speak. Crow magic. Drink water. <laughs> Drink water, you filthy bastard, bitch. Mm. Oh fuck my arm. Oh fuck. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, I almost forgot you guys were my friends. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally <laughs> shaking. Oh fuck! Please don't hurt me, please, please. Oh no. What did you say? Yeah. Yeah. What did you say? Yeah, catch. <laughs> you just <laughs> bite my hands. Uh, I'm going to have to buff this out. Peasant gems. Peasant gems. Six feet apart at least, please. <laughs> so, I see you're a bomb mate. My face is very <laughs> so wait, like, are you two twins? Oh, yeah. Or twin scribes. Oh, I'm just trying to go full. Yeah, twin scribes, people! Twin scribes! There's something obvious that Let us say, what do you guys think of the keep so far? Do you think Sorry I'll about get the uh, scuff in the beginning. <laughs> it's still kind of scuff, but I like it. Yes. Oh, like it was I want to do a thing. Attention. <laughs> oh, is he coming back? Alright, sorry. <laughs> Okay, I want to get floss on the table! Oh, <laughs> this is our chance to run! This is not your chance. <laughs> you run, you die. You're fucking rocks at people. <laughs> you run, you die. You run, you die. Oh, wait. No, start kicking again. Start, uh, Mary, no, start kicking again. Start kicking again. <laughs> I'll throw it back make me to safety! Don't you will. <laughs> 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 no, I need to kill you, Mirandel. I'm literally back for a real god, Mirandel. Throw it back oh, for a real god, Mirandel. Throw it back for a real god, Mirandel. Get us out of here. Holy shit, he's silent. Bear man. So fast. Quiet comes. <laughs> We're okay. Okay, honey. Something fun.
funny, you one-eared rapist. <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> settle down. Settle down. Okay, just settle down. Settle down. Oh, no, everyone, 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 everyone. Cool. Show it your face. Okay. Eight cards. Two. One. On. Uh, the end. And this is what we shall do. Both of these choices that I have been given incite treason. I cannot risk it, not with all the facts, not with all the information that I still need. You are going to report to me on whether or not you see Godfrey return to Ledford or the deeds of advisor Fulgriff. I have to know this before I act. But even as a precaution, I must mobilize and prepare to march to Adwick. If you send your information by Raven, I should get it before anything drastic is done. But I must know. Otherwise, a terrible mistake could be made. Captain. I want 40 horses ready. A detachment of the Royal Guard will be leaving for Adwick in the morning. Is that clear? To hear is to obey, Lord. As for the rest of you, you are to say nothing about this missive to anyone. If I was to go with my instinct, I'd have you all executed to prevent word from spreading. But I do not like wanton murder. And if there is the smallest chance that you are telling the truth, insofar as much you thought that Godfrey sent you with this missive, or even if he did, you still risked it. Even if you were misled, you were loyal. That I cannot punish. I'm faced with a choice that I'm afraid. <sighs> Never mind. Guards! Escort them out. You heard them? If I do not get single, single fail. I promise that you will be dead in the night. God. Move. I turn my head. Wait. I thank you for this promotion. You're so good at it. Mm. No. Ah, look, look at you. <laughs> Today, good <laughs> evening, Godsman. Uh, uh. <clears throat> well, let us not dally. Me too. Me too. Let us definitely not dally. Yes. Like Fucking shit, how do we make it alive? Hold, out. Hold the gate. <clears throat> They're coming through a lot. <clears throat> right, who? Each of you Just... will remain. One at a time, if you would, for your weaponry. Where is Sarah here? First. Ah. 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Over his first one at a time, please. Yeah, can you take his first? You next. Go ahead, you little stiff there, soldier. <clears throat> and. Uh, thank you. Oh, just good to see you. If. Uh, give him any <sighs> trouble. Oi. <sighs> Holy ah, shit. I don't want to give any trouble. <laughs> right. Let's be on our way. Let's not fucking stop. <clears throat> yes. <clears throat> I want to stop for a second. You fuck his family, don't you? You sure you don't want to spend a good time? <clears throat> Y'all did good on my jaw. <laughs> <clears throat> Bloody hell. <sighs> Oi. <clears throat> Open the gates. Oh, it's stuck. The fuck what? you mean it's Are stuck? Come on. Kidding me? Get it open. Give it a second. It's old, you know. Enjoy your stay, castle. <laughs> I'm coming <laughs> to help. Enjoy your stay, Dunstead. Hmm. Thank you. It was <sighs> wonderful. It was lovely. It was very oh, hospitable. Won't come oh. back again. Mm. Thank you. Oh, as I said, <laughs> if it's hospitality, you want. <laughs> We're more than happy to oblige you. <laughs> I mean, if it's not working, you can always drop a rope off the side and we'll just, you know, sally on down. Oh, oh if we can give you a hand on that. I'd be more than happy to toss you over the wall. Let's... Don't forget the rope part. Nudge. He never fixes anything. Never fixes anything. <laughs> oh, then I wouldn't get to hear the squelch. If we need rope, I? I have rope on me. Oi. Do the top, do the tower. That way you hear the like. <laughs> I do enjoy the screaming. On, uh, I do enjoy the screaming on the way down. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Good, sir. Get back out there with the rest of us. Oh, Gentlemen. There are the gates open. It's time to go. Oi! You drowned. Get out of there. Get out. We don't need oh, shut around your around here. <laughs> what are you doing in there? Good rain. Oh, fucking come back. Uh, I you pick a rock out of pocket. How the fuck do we make it alive? <sighs> That's done Sarah, instead what for you. Do you have a death wish? It's a rock. What are they gonna do? Cry? Kill you, probably. Boo boo hoo. They can fucking catch me. Hopefully they don't find the chair. Oh, well, can you outrun a crossbow bolt? Or, we need to uh, get our story up. straight. Actually, actually, I can. Can I not, uh, Kate? I can would much I like... not? Listen, I've had enough done today for one night. I would much like to not recall... I agree with Kyla, however. We should get our story straight. Should we not? The story is we delivered the missive. Nothing more. Everything we no, need to... Is. No, Didn't people... Didn't we tell everyone way. we went to Ardwick? No. That yes? is true, we told no. everyone except for me. I never said I, I wasn't. I never said I was. So, to keep Listen. the story straight. In order to make sure that we came home alive, we made sure that someone knew. Two people know. Right? Service, you freeze. While you're absentmindedly looking at the ground while you walk, you see something. Fresh footprints. They don't go down the road, they go to the left and the right. Hello? Sarah? All of you mm -hmm. here right. sheaths. Swords, tools, right. and their scabbards. <laughs> Weapons. Get to the trees. No! What? what? <laughs> Careful! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Careful! <laughs> In the back. And then you front, your footwork lends itself well, and you catch the enemy in the side. Oh. 
Johnny, you found a chink in the man's armor, and you stab into his right arm. This man is stabbed in the throat of his sleeve. Back of the neck. A dagger slipped in the back of this mercenary's neck and he dropped to the ground. Back to the neck. There's a gap in the back of your neck. Keep this one alive. Keep him alive. The in the back of the night takes his life. I'll leave them alive. You suddenly hear a sound. The gates to Dunstead opening, many torches, the sound of many feet. Oh, what the hell? Oh, come on, come on! To go now. Drags it off the road. No, it's too many. No, come on, we're running. They know, they know they're against us. They know we should tell them they attacked us and be fucking honest. You're right. They already know we're fucking against us. They tried to kill us before we could get back to Ledford. Don't think I won't knock a bow right in your face. We just we got mugged! Us. We were defending ourselves. They're trying to kill us on the way home. Really? Mm. Oh yes, we met them out here to attack them. Why were they out here oh. in the first place? Funny thing. Oh, that's a very you all you you're seeing that you cause something that's trouble here. Third time to charm us, they say. To be fair, we're not the keep. Get the We're fuck not in the out of here! Leave! We don't want <laughs> don't you here! Try to... I don't know who this man were, but try to find out! <laughs> Come on! They told us to leave! The crossbow bolt thuds in the dirt at your feet. I will miss next time. Come on. Alright. At least out of the view of the crossbow. 